Hey, welcome back. I'm John. I'm Joey. What do you think is the most requested product at VAT19? Oh, that's easy. You know what it is? Oh, yeah. I know what it is. Yeah. It's in this box. It is. We got it. It's finally here. You guys have asked for this for like eight years. Nine years? I think forever. 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 Since forever. Yeah. You've been asking for this. We got it. It's happening. Let's beat Let's this. Let's beat this. I can't wait to oh, get into that. The sour world's largest gummy worm. <sighs> Same world's largest gummy worm that you know and love. But sour. But sour. And that sour is like your jam. So oh, I love sour. I assume that you go for like, if there are regular gummy worms and sour gummy worms, you're going for the sour. I'm going time. for the sour. I go for the Sour Patch Kids. Mm -hmm. I go for the sour. We have sour cotton candy here at Vat19 that I'm always. Okay, so you know like you go to the gas station and you, you get the, the gummy worms and if you're like me, you reach for the sour ones. They're probably just like coated in like a light dusting of sour, sour dust. This. It's different than those little tiny ones you're used to because it's infused. It's got the sour it's through and through. Sour throughout. It's just full of sour and it's coated in sour too. It's, it smells so good. It's just like the regular world's largest gummy worm. That's our second most popular video, the world's largest gummy worm, because uh -huh. it's just so crazy and awesome. We've just taken the crazy and awesome up a notch of crazy awesome. This is dual flavored. So you got your red cherry, you got your blue raspberry. Oh, this thing it? is over two feet long. And if you get it warm, it can stretch even further. <laughs> That's very true. Did we do a burning questions yes, on that? Yes, we have. It's roughly three pounds. 480 calories? No, no, no. 4,080 calories. What am I talking 4, about? 4,080 4, calories. 80 calories. That's two days worth of cows. So we're only going to each eat half. Yeah, right? well, I mean, we'll each, right yeah. Then we'll just not have to eat for the rest of the day. Exactly. That's how that works. That's how that works. <laughs> just cut it in half. Exactly. And you're good for the day. But if you're not like us and you're not going to eat this entire thing in one sitting, mm -hmm. you could put it back in the resealable bag. Oh, that's true. It does. That. Yeah, it's got a little zipper bag on that's, it. That's nice. It lasts with the shelf life's about a year. Why are we not eating this? I don't know. All right, I'm, I'm digging in. <sighs> it smells so good. Mm. Oh my goodness. It's so heavy. Oh no. That's it's, too good. It's too good. It's definitely sour. Mm -hmm. It's so soft. Really easy to just kind of sink your super teeth tender. in. Oh, you know what I'm about to do? I'm about to. Oh, twofer. Mm -hmm. Get the middle. Look at that. We got a little red cherry, a little bit of blue raspberry. Mm. Since we came out with the gummy watermelon on mm -hmm. a stick, mm -hmm. that's been my favorite gummy so far. Uh oh. That we sell. Drum roll. It's still second. Oh, okay. but, but it made it, it edged out. Some of the other ones that I love. Yeah. I just really like watermelon candy. And you really like sour candy. Where does this sit on your list? I know, man. I w this might be my favorite. I really like the the brain. The gummy brain has that fruit punch flavor. Clearly, you do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to regret this later. I feel like you might. I think I'm going to call it. This might be my favorite. I think this, is gonna be, this, this is my favorite. Wow. It's not like so sour. Yeah, it's not like sucking on a lemon. Yeah, where you just like, I can't take another bite. It's not even quite like a Sour Patch Kid. It's not that, it's not that sour. Just enough mm -hmm. to be like really enjoyable. Mm -hmm. It's like adding sour cream to a baked potato. Yeah, you can have a baked potato without it. Mm -hmm. Still good. Still great. This is just like a different kind of baked potato. Yeah. Now we got to figure out some things to do in the commercial. That's right. For this Sour World's Largest Gummy Worm. Since the original World's Largest Gummy Worm video was our second most popular of all time, we've really got our work cut out for us on this one. The bar is high. It is. We could go fishing again. We could go fishing again because that guy, Jamie's character, See, I bought my trophy, son. Mm -hmm. He hasn't come back. That's true. That's, That's his only appearance. It's a one and done. Oh, you know what we gotta do? Eat this with an emberry and compare it to the regular one. Ooh! The emberry, if you don't know, is an all natural little tablet that we sell here at Vat19. You let it dissolve on your tongue mm -hmm. and then it like physically changes your taste buds mm -hmm. so that sour things, they taste sweet. Mm -hmm. It like doesn't let you taste sourness. I wonder if that would work with this. I'm sure it would. And I just don't know what it, what it would taste like. Would it taste just like a regular cherry and blue raspberry gummy worm? I don't know, but my mind is blown and I really want to try that. I really do too. I kind of think you could make like a faux documentary on like how the sour world's mm. largest gummy worm came about because I mean, it's been almost 10 years of people asking for this thing. It hasn't been a thing before, so I, I feel like you could make up a story about how like it was scientifically impossible and and now the scientists finally figured out how to do it and then you could like slice it open and show like the infused sour molecules and... Mm -hmm. I mean, you know when like babies or really young kids eat mm -hmm. sour, they make hilarious faces. That's true. Maybe just get like a bunch of kids in here. And try it out. It kind of looks frozen. Like it all, the, all these does. crystals. Maybe we can play around with the temperature of perfect, gummy. Perfect temperature of gummy. Yeah, what's the perfect? That's a burning question. You wouldn't want to get it too cold. 
Because yeah. then it'd just be like biting a brick. Yeah. But if you got it too warm, then you're not, oh, it's not gummy anymore. It's just, just goo. Jelly. I was thinking of warming it up and stretching it out really far. Mm-hmm. Could you make like a giant bass guitar? I don't know. No, not so much. It's got to vibrate a lot faster than that. A lot faster than that. (laughs) That was just a few of our ideas. If you have your own idea, let us know in the comments because, I mean, you never know. We might take that idea and run with it. Mm -hmm. Who knows? That idea might make it in the video. Yeah, that's right. It could get 70 million views. And then you could be like, Mm mm-hmm. Tell all your friends. That was Mm -hmm. my idea. So this is my favorite part of the show Mm -hmm. where we... Just take another bite. Well, yeah, that's really good. Come on. But what were we going to say? We peep it, they keep it. Ah! So, you've got a chance to win your very own Sour World's Largest Gummy Worm. Just check the description below for details, and uh, you could be snacking for freezies. Well, if you like this video and you want to see us unbox some more brand new things at VAT19, mm-hmm. make sure you subscribe to VAT19 here on YouTube, and all of the new videos will be sent right to you. Click that little bell notification. You'll get a notification right on your phone. All right, thanks for sticking with us. Thanks for watching us eat, but I know it's better to try it yourself. Mm. So go pick up your own Sour World's Largest Gummy Worm, and uh, we'll see you next time. Later, peeps. That19.com